In a recent article, Nushan Guru Militia Man highlighted a significant development in Iraq's financial landscape that could have far-reaching implications for the country's economy and its currency. The article details the successful negotiations between Iraq's central bank, the U.S. Federal Reserve, and the U.S. Treasury, culminating in a breakthrough that might drastically reduce Iraq's reliance on the U.S. dollar. This shift comes in the form of diversifying the basket of commercial currencies, which signals a potential turning point for the Iraqi dinar and its role in global commerce. For years, Iraq has heavily relied on the U.S. dollar for international transactions and trade. This dependence has, at times, placed constraints on the country's economic sovereignty and exposed it to the vagaries of U.S. monetary policy. However, the recent negotiations in Washington mark a strategic move by Iraq's central bank to diversify its currency basket, effectively allowing it to conduct international trade in a variety of currencies, rather than being almost exclusively tethered to the U.S. dollar. The implications of this move are profound. By broadening the range of currencies it deals with, Iraq is setting the stage for a more stable and resilient economy. A diversified currency basket can reduce the country's exposure to fluctuations in the value of any single currency, particularly the U.S. dollar, which has been subject to significant volatility in recent years. This diversification is a calculated effort to mitigate risks and provide a more balanced approach to international trade and finance. Moreover, this change could lead to a significant decrease in the demand for the U.S. dollar within Iraq. As businesses and traders begin to conduct more transactions in other currencies, the domestic need for dollars could diminish, easing pressure on the central bank to maintain large dollar reserves. This shift could also stabilize the exchange rate of the Iraqi dinar, which has been under considerable strain, trading at around 310 dinars to the dollar. It's important to note that such a substantial policy change would likely not occur if the dinar were to remain at its current rate. The very act of diversifying currency options suggests that the central bank anticipates a stronger dinar capable of holding its own in a basket of international currencies. In practical terms, this means that Iraq is positioning itself to become a more attractive partner for global trade. With a stronger dinar and a diversified currency portfolio, Iraq can engage more effectively with international markets. Countries and businesses around the world are more likely to do business with Iraq if they see that its currency is stable and supported by a broad range of international currencies. This could lead to increased foreign investment, more robust economic growth, and ultimately, a higher standard of living for the Iraqi people. However, the road ahead is not without challenges. Implementing such a significant shift in currency policy requires careful management and coordination between the central bank, government agencies, and the private sector. It will also require sustained international support, particularly from key economic partners like the United States. The recent meetings in Washington, which lasted for three days, were a critical step in securing this support and ensuring that all parties are aligned in their goals for Iraq's economic future. In conclusion, the decision to diversify Iraq's currency basket is a bold and strategic move that could reshape the country's economic landscape. By reducing its reliance on the U.S. dollar and embracing a broader range of currencies, Iraq is taking a crucial step towards economic independence and stability. As this policy begins to take effect, the world will be watching closely to see how it impacts the Iraqi dinar, the country's economy, and its role in global trade. If successful, this could be a turning point that ushers in a new era of prosperity for Iraq and its people.